I love the new fall items this year. There's so many new decor items out. I can't wait to show you. So this section definitely caught my eye. They have these new fabric houses and I love how these look. I feel like they're really unique and look very high end. Don't forget to check out the wall decor. Now you have signs like this one, like this Hello Fall sign, but you also have things like this that are very neutral that you could add into existing decor that you have at your house. Of course, there's always several pumpkin options out. Now a new one I'm seeing this year is called a Flock Velvet Pumpkin. It comes in three different colors and it gives off a real matte appearance. Now all the products I'm showing you in today's video, you can find at walmart.com. And I wanna thank Walmart for sponsoring today's video. You can also pick up glass pumpkins in this amber color. There's also, I don't know, this one's kind of a green gray. Let me know down in the comments. Do you think this color is green or gray? And the mushroom trend came back this year. There's another amber glass item. This is actually a mushroom vase in the amber color. And then there's another mushroom item I thought was super adorable with this little Sherpa top. My prediction for the viral item this fall is going to be these pumpkins right here. These are a braided pumpkin and they come in three different colors. They are so cute, so adorable. You're gonna want to definitely pick these up. They come in white and then this beautiful sage green color and then this brown camel color. Now over here by my front door, these are the decorations I had out this summer. I wanna swap out a few items to really change the cozy vibe for fall. I've been super excited to get this mirror. This is a viral mirror from Walmart. I think it's so perfect for fall. If you watched my last Walmart video, you probably remember seeing this lamp. I didn't pick it up last time, so I had to get it. I'm gonna be putting it here on my entryway table. Next, I'm going to add on these braided pumpkins. Now I have three braided pumpkins. There's a lot of ways that you can style your pumpkins. You could put them out and have three in a row. But one of my favorite ways to style multiple pumpkins that are the same size, you can use any books you have around your house or you can thrift them. But this helps to elevate your pumpkin. So I'm going to play around with it and see what looks best. Walmart has so many great pumpkin options and this year there's several new ones. Now one of the ones I'm really drawn to is this tiered sweater pumpkin. Look how adorable that is and I just love the colors. Now, if you're into ceramic pumpkins, I have another option for you. This is a light up ceramic pumpkin. There's a little switch on the bottom. How adorable is this? I want to add a few pumpkins to my kitchen and I have my eye on this one down here. This Sherpa pumpkin is so adorable. Love the white color. So I think I'm going to get this one. Now I want to get a smaller option, maybe in an orange or amber color. So I'm drawn to these pumpkins down here. This is that flocked kind of velvet look again. They have them in a white cream color. And then there's also two different shades of orange. Which pumpkin should I pick? I feel like this orange one is pretty, but I also love the braided pumpkin. Which one would you guys pick? Let me know down in the comments. I found this gorgeous burlwood tray on walmart.com. I love the size of it. It's gonna be perfect to put out in my kitchen. So I'm gonna put it at the end of my island. So I picked up the Sherpa pumpkin. I love that, but I ended up going with a different pumpkin that I didn't even show you guys. This is a flocked velvet white pumpkin. I think that's gonna look perfect styled with my tray. Now on my tray, I'm gonna show you a great easy fall breakfast that you can put together in just a few minutes. I'm gonna add parchment paper to my cooking sheet. You're gonna need a can of cinnamon rolls. Place those out on your baking sheet. After you put your cinnamon rolls on your baking sheet, you're going to need to cut small pieces of twine that you're gonna to use to pinch on the sides of your cinnamon rolls. You can do three or four strings per cinnamon roll. So to add your string, you're going to take it and put it underneath your cinnamon roll, kind of like you're doing a ribbon on a package. So pull it on either side, cross it, and then pull it to the back, pulling it again on the sides, and then you're gonna tie it on the back. 
now you're going to take another piece and you're going to do it the other way. So you're going to place it on the sides, go to the back, make sure to pull in and go to your final side, pull in and tie. It really doesn't matter which side you decide to tie it on, but you do want to double knot it. And then you can cut off the excess string. Then just place them in the oven according to the package directions. They look so good. Next, I'm just gonna remove the twine and add on the icing. I'm gonna finish them off by adding cinnamon sticks as a stem. I think a whole one's a little too long, so let's break them in half. I'll add a few oranges to my plate. I'm gonna peel them and then add a little chocolate chip for the stem. If you've made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. Comment the word of the day, which is pumpkin. If you're wanting to save some money and decorate for both Halloween and fall at the same time, an easy money saving hack you can do is to buy jack-o'-lanterns. They're perfect for October, but then in September, just turn them around so they look like pumpkins. Do not sleep on the fall home decor section. There's so many good options. I'm loving all of these vases. Like, can you believe how good this wood vase is? I absolutely think this would be gorgeous sitting out in your home. There's a brown amber vase that's really pretty. I also love this one, super high-end looking. I mean, really all of these vases are absolutely gorgeous. This arch tabletop clock is very much on trend. I love this plaid rug. It's so affordable. This would be perfect in front of your front door, or you could also put it, I think it would be great, by your kitchen sink. Now, a hot item you may want to be on the lookout for is this scallop tray. I've been seeing this all over the internet. It's a really pretty tray. Love the detail, but I also love this scallop woven bowl. This would be perfect to sit out in your kitchen for fall. Just put your cute little pumpkins in there. I also love this little gold leaf trinket tray. They also have several new options for fall wall art. So many great new pillows for us to choose from this fall. This neutral one is great, but it has a little bit of added texture if you like a neutral look. I also think the scallop is very big this year. This is a scallop pillow, and I'm also seeing this sage green color quite a bit here at Walmart for fall. I also like these brown floor cushion options. These are really big, perfect for adding additional seating. Now, don't be overwhelmed and feel like you have to change everything in your home. Making a few simple swaps can really give you those cozy fall vibes. Maybe changing or adding a new vase to your home in those fall colors, or you could add one of those pillows that I was showing you to really warm up your space. I have a corner in my bedroom that I've really been wanting to swap out for a new look, so let's do that. I found this new chair by Better Homes and Gardens. I really wanted a larger chair that was a little bit more comfy for this reading corner. Now, all the items I'm showing you, I bought on walmart.com. Don't worry, I'll have them linked for you in the description box. If you don't wanna get out of bed at night to turn off your lamp, you need to pick up one of these smart plugs. I'm gonna plug in the smart plug and then put the power on. Next, I'll just connect the smart plug to my phone and then I can just turn it on from my phone. How cute is this table I found and it's super affordable and you can pick it up in two different colors. I have the light beige color, but it also comes in a black. I found this velvet ottoman on walmart.com. You guys know I've been using this green color a lot lately, but my thought with this is it brings some color into my room. I can also move it around and put my laptop on here, or I can prop my feet up. You could put two of these at the bottom of your bed. I could also see two of these in your living room. Definitely need a cozy blanket for fall. Now I'll just add a few fall accessories to my table. This is one of those new flocked pumpkins that they have, and this one is a gorgeous sweater pumpkin I found.
One of my favorite things to do to get in the fall spirit is make my house smell amazing. And I love to do that by creating a simmer pot. Honestly, a lot of the stuff I'm going to be throwing into my simmer pot, you probably already have in your refrigerator. So start with any pan. I like using one similar to this, and I'm just going to fill it up a little bit with water. Next, you're going to cut up one apple and put it into your simmer pot. Now, what I love about a simmer pot is you can put as little or as much as you like. So just do your favorite scents. I'm gonna be adding in some cinnamon sticks. I'll add about a tablespoon of vanilla extract, a few whole cloves, and I'll add a little bit of rosemary around the edges. Now this is a great way to use up your rosemary if you used it in a recipe and maybe it's getting ready to go bad or it's already gone bad, you could put this in a simmer pot. I'll place it on the stove on the lowest setting. Within a few hours, your house is going to be smelling amazing. Now you can keep this on all day and if it gets low, you just add a little bit of water to it. I want to show you all the fall picks you could find for your arrangements or your wreaths. There's several to choose from. They have two different colors of these Sherpa pumpkins. They also have these. These are pretty cute, adorable. And then there's several leaves and pumpkin options in all different colors, just depending on what your color scheme is. These acorns are cute. I also thought these were very interesting and they have more of those flocked pumpkins just in a smaller size. I found some Halloween rugs that are gonna be perfect to sit outside on your front porch. You can pick up all the items I'm showing you in today's video at walmart.com or I'll put the links for you down in the description box. Make sure you subscribe because I wanna see you back here and I'll see you in our next one. Bye.